Hey. All right, today I'm going to give y'all a little hint on how to make God smile 101. I think I'm saying it right if I start out by saying the way to make God smile is with your tithes and your offering. To cover it, the tithes opens the door and the offering make it flows in. So, you can take $10, you can get $1 and put that $1 in and throw a couple cents in for uh for your offering. You know, that's the tithes or whatever. But if you can get bigger, you get 100, you could just take 10 and put it in. Put a 5 in. How much ever you want to put in that you feel comfortable in saying, "I I gave I gave my best. I gave what you know what I needed to give but as long as you get that ten percent in and even if things get tight you still can give some ties just I mean if it don't have to be the whole thing that's okay God knows your heart he knows it but when you start getting up and higher and higher and get paid more that McDonald's job, that's okay, $10 here, $10 there, that's okay. But when you start making that big money, that in lies the problem. Because then, when you get $1,000 on your check, that $100 is so hard to let go. Why? Because you think of it as, oh, I'm letting go $100, but you're really not letting go $100. I mean, you are, but what I'm saying is that you're letting this go 10%. Of a thousand, you got nine hundred dollars left after you give that one hundred out of that thousand. Because if I made a thousand and I give a hundred, I don't even look at this man, this is a lot of money. What can I do with this? I don't look at what can I do with this. I look at this is my ten percent, and then I throw a little offering in there. Because once that goes in there and you throw that offering in there, the tides brings, brings the window up. The offering lets the blessings flow down. I don't look at it as a hundred. I look at it as, you know what, I'm going to get my blessing. I'm going to get my blessing. The rappers, the singers, the, one of those, they don't even go to church. But guess what? They give their tithes and their offering. They make sure they give that because they know that they're going to bless. God smiles at that. He goes, yeah, I'm getting my part. I'm going to bless them because they are steady with it. Because God knows your heart. If you can't give the most of what you can give, he knows when you're giving it from your heart, that's what counts. God knows your heart. So, in saying that, when you start, you know, doing that, you need to pray and say, hey, let me get a little better. Maybe it's so easy being bad, but hard being good. But just try out a couple hours a day and say, okay, I need to get right on these couple hours a day. And then extend it an hour, an hour, every time you, you feel comfortable with it. And then, boom, all of a sudden, you've been a whole day without doing those bad things that you do. And guess what? God smiles at that, too. Because he's like, look at my child. He, she is trying. That's all he wants you to do. He just wants you to try. And when he sees that, he goes, you know what? That's my child. So more blessings to come flowing, more blessings to come flowing. But with all those blessings flowing, trust me, the devil is at you. He's going to make you want to do bad, so he's going to put it right in your face. But you have to run past that. You have to say no. Every time it comes up, you have to say no. Sooner or later, you will pass that test. And then boom. Then when it comes back around again, you brush it off your shoulder because it ain't really nothing to you anymore. you know. And then you're like, wow, I went past that with no problem. Boom. Then, see, now God smiles at that too. He's like, yeah, my child is overcoming. Overcoming. So, I ain't going to keep it long. I'm, I just want to know, just let you know, God love those tithes. God love those offerings. All you got to do is give from your heart. And even if you give a little extra, hey, more power to you. God bless. Have a good day. And make sure you pray and tell God, give me the strength to be who you want me to be. God bless.